Welcome back everybody to the first GSF game of the week for the 2021 fall season. Presented by Ike's Loving Sandwiches, championship level sandwiches every single time. So pumped to kick off the year with this Thursday night showdown between the Valley Christian Warriors and the Wilcox Chargers. First quarter action, Wilcox on the move. Fourth play from scrimmage, there's our guy, Luther Glenn. Check out the quickness, the speed, he gone. 65 yards to the house. Check out the feature we did on him this past summer with our very own CC Coleman. Must watch the show. First drive for Valley Christian, QB Jackson Berman. This dude is cool. Watch the pass to Jurion Dickey. He gets hijacked by Glenn. Watch the slow-mo, and this is just a quick insight on how smart of a player Dickey is. Wide out, turned cornerback in a split second. Glenn had that interception, but Dickey says, uh-uh, not tonight. So that forced the punt, and VC, they did not have a good start at all. Wild snap, fielded by the punter, which is Dickey. And now, shout out to Wilcox number 74, Santiago Maez, for punching the ball loose. Chargers took over and they cashed in the turnover with the boy, Glenn. Touchdown Wilcox. Extra point was no good, 13 to nothing. Chargers with 6.30 left in the first quarter. Valley Christian got the ball back and they responded with this. A five play, 58 yard touchdown drive. Berman to Dickey. 24 yard connection, Warriors first touchdown of the season, 13 to seven and the first second quarter. Here's Glenn. Powering his way into the end zone. Third touchdown of the night for Glenn. That made it 19 to seven. Chargers, under seven minutes remaining in the half. This was a nice play by Glenn on the four-star national recruit, Jurian Dickey. Touchdown saving pass breakup by Glenn. But on the next play, we were expecting the same play, but Berman decided to keep it. Easy walk in the park. 19 to 14, Valley Christian closed the gap. Warriors got the ball back with 1-11 left in the half and they made the most of the opportunity right here. Six plays, 69 yards with Berman leading the ground attack. Second touchdown for Berman in less than two minutes. Extra point was good, 21 to 19 Warriors with the lead at intermission. Let's go to the third quarter. Jurion Dickey went crazy, untouched to the crib. 91 yard kick return, his second of the night. Touchdown that is, 28 to 19 Valley Christian. Second possession and the half for the Warriors coming up right here, Dickey. He's just hard to stop, man. This was a this was about a 30 yard punt return. And they went for the kill right here. Joshua Minami took the handoff and showcased some skills along the way, but he forgot to tuck the ball tight. I love this hustle play by Zenus Dawn. Punched it loose, and that is a touchback. Wilcox ball on the 20. That was number 25, by the way, who punched the ball out. Warriors got the ball right back, forced the turnover. Recovered by the big man, number 56. Wait for it, there he is. And they picked it up where they left off on offense. Berman to Dickey. Ref said he crossed the line, therefore it is a touchdown. 35 to 19, Warriors. Next, Warriors possession, Andrew Beldy with the early dagger. 44 yard touchdown down the line. Nice block by the pulling guard, number 62, Miles Cluck on Dawn. Number 25 for Wilcox. He was about to make the play, but Miles just stuffed him, allowing Beldy to pass through clean. 42 to 19. Game over? Not, said Elijah Walker. Check this out. 91 yard the other way. That way. 42 to 26, and the comeback was on. Wilcox playing with a sense of urgency now. Daniel Escorza forces a fumble, recovered by Walker, and that pumped up the sidelines even more. 
closing minutes of the third. Crazy sequence right here. Wilcox pretty much ran the same play four times, and this one finally worked. Johnson to Glenn, touchdown, 41 to 33, end of third. But that fire was extinguished right away by the flash. Jackson Berman. He's a runner, he's a track star. No, I cannot sing. What is that? A 55, 56 yard sprint? It's a touchdown, that's what it is. 47, 33, Warriors pulled away quick. Key play right here for the defense. Seth Shermerhorn with the sack. Turnover on downs, which led to this. Berman rolled his ankle and lost the shoe. Unbelievable. But he's flash. And like The Rock said, it doesn't matter if you have shoes or not. Still got the first down. And I called this one. Just watch. Dickey with his fourth touchdown of the night. That's his patented play. Valley Christian up 54 to 33 with five. 54 to 33 with 530 left. One more. We'll end with this. Charlie Carlson of Wilcox with a nice catch and run right here on his way to the end zone. But I love this hustle play right here. Carlos Lopez tracked him down. And that is how we'll end this first GSF game of the week highlight reel. Valley Christian with a big season opener win over Wilcox, 54 to 33. Time now for the most electrifying sports entertainment host in the universe. Take it away, Leroy. What's up, GSF University, man? Leave the order come to you live in your living room out here at Wilcox High School with the Warriors behind me with the big one on Wilcox. Make some noise, baby. GSF University, we're gonna get straight to some interviews. All right, who we gonna get first? Hey, hey. Where we at, where we at, hey? hey. Where he is? Jackson, get Jackson up here. Where's Jackson at, number 11? Hey. Oh, hey. oh, hey. track star, hey. Hey, hey. hey, real talk though. Appreciate you, brother, appreciate you. Hey, look, back to my brother Jackson, man. Hey, quarterback of the night. Look, it's been a long time since we got back to some contact sports. Yeah. Can you talk about the process and how you guys prepare for this first game against Wilcox? I mean, we were all like, like really pent up, not gonna lie, because like we didn't really play as good in the scrimmage as we wanted to, but we finally get to hit somebody else and bring somebody down. I mean, we started slow, obviously. Like, as, I mean, I, I don't remember last time I been down 14-0, but then I, then we go like, then we tie it like 14-14. Our defense starts getting some stops, and then I think we're up like by one before the half. And I just want to say like the defense and the special teams won that for us right now. Like our offense started off slow. Like our first drive was bad. Our line though, I don't think I got sacked once, did I? Oh, I don't think so. No sex. No sex. So, so I just want to say thank you to the big dogs. I want to say thank you, Jurion. Thank you, Kai. Kai stepped up too. Sophomore play tonight. Now I, I want to say thank you though. Most important, the lineman and Chase. Oh, yep. thank Chase. You. I appreciate Absolutely. You. Hey, shout out to lineman. Hey, I'm not done with you. Yet. I'm not done with you, brother. Yeah, we we still going. Hey, so talk about 14-0, man. You know, you guys are down in the beginning of the game. What kind of adjustments are you guys making? What are the coaches saying to you guys to help you get back into it? I mean, we just had no intensity. Like, I, I mean, offensively, we had one drive, it stalled out, but I think we only threw the ball once. Our run game just wasn't clicking either, but um, I think on the on the defensive side, too, we just weren't trusting one another. Like, a guy was trying to do too many jobs because we weren't we haven't played together, so we wouldn't know. But when they started finally trusting each other and everybody's clicking, like, we're going to be a hard team to beat. I feel it. Nah, for real, though. For real, though. You was talking about run game, though. You talking about run game. It like you discovered a little track star in you or something, man. Can you talk about what you saw against the Wilcox defense when it opened up and how you guys uh, actually got came forward with the run offense? Um, so I think I think in the beginning when we were stalling out, we started throwing the ball and then they started spreading everybody and they had like uh, three linebackers in the middle of the field was just wide open. And then um, and then I slipped out for one of them and I just stepped up and I saw nobody there and I just scrambled the end zone. Absolutely. Yes, sir, man. We had a great game today. I got an award for you, my brother. You are the playmaker of the game, my G. Yeah. Yes, sir. All right. Bring him up here. Bring him back. Bring him back. Bring him back. Yeah. Bring him back. Hey, we got an award yeah. for you, my brother. Here's an Ike's gift card. Thank you. Oh. And here's a shirt. Hold it up. And you also get a shirt as well. My brothers hold that up. You know what I'm saying? You dig, my brother Jackson. Congratulations. GSF the best, baby. GSF the best. Let's go. You heard it from Jackson, baby. Absolutely. All right, hey, who's next? Who's next? Where we at? Where is 
Dicky, man. Where's Dicky at? Bring Dicky up here. Dicky, oh. All right, all right, yep. Hey, man, wide out of the day. You know what I mean? You out there on the island by yourself, man. What do you got to tell the kids about prepping to be a wide out at varsity football? Um, honestly, just say, just be a dog. Play with heart and go out there and then beat your defenders. Be a dog. That's it. Absolutely. Be a dog, baby. Hey, so watching you play against these corners, man, it was looking like there were some physical defenders. How were you adjusting and what were you guys talking about as wideout coaches to make uh, adjustments to come out with the win? Um, our adjustments, well, it was complicated, but um, in the beginning, we was a little, um, a little messing up in the beginning, but then we started prepping. Me, uh, me and Berman started talking, then we started talking about what leverage was they giving us, and it was every leverage that they was giving us, we was taking it. Absolutely, yes, sir. So I want to talk about that kickoff return, though, man. You know, it was the second half, you know what I mean? You see that ball coming down. What were you seeing as that play was unraveling? When you on kickoff, I ain't going to lie, everything is slow motion. So, like, you read everything, and then I saw the hole, so I just took off and started running. Yes, sir, to the end zone, you feel me? All right, well, I got an award for you, my brother. You are the MVP of the game, my G. Yeah! Absolutely. I got a car for you, feel me? So get yourself a sandwich. Well, I can take that. Shirt. And a shirt, you feel me? Hold that up for him one time, you know what I mean? You did. Yes, sir. Good game, bro. All right, hey, and with that, that wraps up Guess Sports Folks interviews, everybody. Who's going to break us out? Someone break us out? Where Marcus at? Get Marcus up here. Let's go. go. As a team, as a team, as a family. Break it on Brian Ready. Yes, sir. And you heard the first time Guess Sports Folks, and you heard it up. Do it, everybody, signing out. Woo.